Okay, we're up to E flat minor seven or D sharp minor seven. We're gonna use the same process as before. We're gonna take E minor seven and we're gonna flip that around so my first finger's a little more comfortable to make the bar. And I'm gonna bring that all the way down here to the 11th fret. So here I am, 11th fret with the bar. I have my ring finger on the fifth string, what looks like the 13th fret. So this turns into D sharp minor seven or E flat minor seven. And then I can take the same idea, but this time with an A form, right? So I'm taking A minor seven, flipping it around so I have my first finger free, moving that up to the sixth fret. And here's that A minor shape, A minor seven shape. But now we've turned it into D sharp minor seven or E flat minor seven. 